is there really a passenger service in the United States that allows you to bring your vehicle with you to your destination? Yes. Today we're going to examine such a service, Amtrak's Auto Train, what it is and how it came to be. A train enthusiast named Eugene Garfield had the innovative idea of bringing your vehicle with you while traveling by train. He founded the Auto Train Corporation in 1971. Auto Train Corporation purchased their locomotives and rail cars from many different sources, therefore they were many different colors. This led to the endearing nickname, the Rainbow Train. Auto Train Corporation operated two routes, one between Kentucky and Florida, and the other between Virginia and Florida. In 1976, there were two minor derailments and a major derailment in 1978. These derailments led to service interruption, loss of revenue, and many lawsuits. These financial hardships eventually forced the Auto Train Corporation into bankruptcy, causing them to close their doors in April of 1981. Many people thought this was the end of an innovative way to travel, but they were wrong. After 22 months without service, Amtrak, also known as the National Railroad Passenger Corporation, stepped in. Amtrak pur purchased the Lorton, Virginia terminal, the Sanford, Florida terminal, and the auto carriers. Soon after, Amtrak renamed the service, calling it Amtrak's Auto Train. Service then opened, and the inaugural trip was in on October 30th of 1983. For the first year, Amtrak's Auto Train operated on a tri-weekly basis using one train consist and two operating crews. After purchasing a, another set of equipment in 1984, they switched to daily service using two consists and five operating crews. Today, Amtrak's auto train still operates between Lorton, Virginia and Sanford, Florida. They carry approximately 200,000 passengers per year, generating about $50 million annually. Amtrak is considered to be the best paying train in terms of operating costs versus income. What makes Amtrak's auto train so special? Well, there's non-stop travel. There are absolutely no service stops between Lorton and Virginia. You get to bring your car with you. Vehicles are loaded aboard two or three level auto carrier cars, which are then attached at the rear of the train consist for travel. Travel is all inclusive aboard Amtrak's auto train. Your ticket and price includes dinner with wine and dessert, movie, snacks, and breakfast in the morning. Amtrak's auto train is the only train in the United States that allows smoking on board. They are equipped with two superliner lounge cars that have a separate smoking section on the lower level of the lounge car. Amtrak's auto train is the longest passenger train in the world and is over a half of a mile long. The Amtrak auto train consists is made up of two diesel engine locomotives, 10 passenger cars, two lounge cars, three dining cars, 12 auto carriers, and one crew car because the crew actually lives on the train for three days at a time. I hope you've enjoyed our trip through history with Amtrak's auto train. I know I have. I'd like to thank you for your time and I hope you have a wonderful day.